Many civil engineering structures are affected by wind aerodynamics. In some cases, the fluid structure interactions may lead to failures because of flutter on vortex shedding induced vibrations. One example is the flow past a circular cylinder, which is one of the most complicated flow situations considering the simplicity of the geometry. When a fluid flow past the circular cylinder, vortices are shed alternately from one side to the other of the cylinder, resulting in a pattern of vortices rotating in opposite directions behind the cylinder. This flow pattern is called the Kármán vortex straight or Kármán straight or vortices. The movement of the separation points cause an oscillating pressure at the cylinder surface, which in turn may cause structural vibration in a direction transverse to the main wind direction. A number of mitigation measures were developed to reduce the adverse impacts and are discussed within this video movie. Industrial chimneys are often protected from this phenomenon by strikes, that is spirals, attached at the top to induce flow separation at a fixed location and to prevent the oscillations, as illustrated on this photograph. Vortex shedding behind a circular cylinder may be prevented by installing a splitter plate in the wake downstream of the cylinder. The plate restricts the interaction between the left and right separation regions, and in turn, reduce the vortex shedding oscillations. The plate may be solid or perforated. A different technique is using wall suction to prevent flow separation. A similar approach was developed for the ship Alcyon of Jacques-Yves Cousteau with a sketch here, leading to a significant lift force in a manner comparable to the Magnus effect. A different approach is based upon the ventilation of the wake region, also called bleeding. With this figure, the stagnation pressure feed the wake cavity, resulting in a stable recirculation region. Surface roughness may also be used to fix the separation points and reduce the vortex shedding. The surface roughness may be placed asymmetrically or symmetrically on the upper half of the cylinder. It forces separation at fixed location to prevent the vortex shedding oscillation. An alternative may be the proximity of a wall or a solid boundary. The wall is known to affect both the wake region and the alleyway fluid flow. The above methods are some among several to suppress the adverse impact of vortex shedding behind a circular cylinder, including using oscillating walls, flexible walls, and transverse traveling wave. The flow past the cylinder is one of the most complicated flow situations considering its simplicity. It remains a fascinating flow pattern with many practical applications. The development of effective mitigation measure against transverse vibration is not trivial. A basic understanding of the fluid dynamics processes is critical in many real-world applications, including airplane, engineering infrastructure, and more. The first discussed is a number of relevant YouTube video movies in the same playlist.